also he uh, talked about uh, these wounds which are uh, set in the genre of abstracts. Uh, Santos, uh, basically, he set the organization of these moves in the field of applied linguistics. The father of those authors is the Swedes, John Swedes, in his book, Jean Analysis in Academic Writing, uh, a very interesting uh, detail or information set in this book. Now I'm going to consider examples of abstract moves. These examples are taken uh, from well-written papers in order to know or in order to um, arrange our abstract according to them. Introduction move. And the introduction move, a researcher is in a position to express or to demonstrate his research area plus its centrality. For example, the article is devoted to the study of language representations of the concept of women in the minds of the Russian and the Chinese people. As you can see, that the writer is directly coming to his research area. Where in the first sentence of his abstract? Another type. Sometimes writers include within their first sentence the gap or their research problem together in the same sentence. For example, بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم من دواعي سرورنا لهذا اليوم أن نقدم الحلقة النقاشية الثالثة لقسم الترجمة قام بإلقاء البحث الدكتور جواد جابر المعارج تناول في بحثه موضوع مستخلصات رسائل الماجستير ونقاط الضعف في إعداد هذه المستخلصات و اقترح نموذج تبني نموذج معين يتكون من خمس نقاط لكتابة هذه المستخلصات حقيقة مستخلصات الرسائل هي عبارة عن مشكلة عامة وليست مشكلة خاصة في قسم معين أو كلية معينة ومشكلة تحتاج إلى العلاج من في الجامعة بشكل عام these studies cannot explain to what extent the developmental timeline is influenced. You know that the adverb, however, as well, is contrasting what is mentioned before. And there is a kind of uh, negative element, which is what? Which is coming on. Another example. Few studies. This is what? This is a gap. This is a kind of uh, a research problem the writer is emphasizing. Few studies, however, have examined patterns in partial waveform learning as method. The purpose move. Dear colleagues, there is a kind of a formula for this move. We have a dialectic element plus an equally type or genre, plus reporting verbs. كانت حلقتنا النقاشية اليوم حول البناء الخطابية لكتابة المستخلصات في رسائل الماجستير في قسم الترجمة وتناولنا فيها تنظير لخمس نقلات وخطوات لكتابة المستخلص منها مثلا نذكر المقدمة ونذكر الغرض من الدراسة ونذكر منهجية الدراسة ونذكر نتائج الدراسة ومن ثم نأتي إلى الاستنتاجات اللي مشار إلها في تلك الدراسة وكان هناك تحليل لستة نماذج لستة رسائل ماجستير
an experimental investigation of the prosodic encoding of topic and focus in Mandarin by examining the isyllabic subject nouns elicited in four discourse contents. As you can see, in this sentence there are two moves together. Some of the scholars who tackled the point of writing an abstract say yes, it is permissible to include two moves within one sentence. This paper reports this is the purpose of the study. And by examining which are which is or which are underlined, this is what this is a reference to the method of his research. Part of it. The method move. Uh, this move gives information about the design of the research, the procedures of the research. There are assumptions, or there is one assumption, the approach, the data, etc. Example. Based on the analysis of 354 apologies made in the Israeli public discourse, between 1997 and 2004, I can straight. Look, the researcher is using the pronoun I. This is his authorial position. I can tactics which range on four main categories. There are characteristics in this move. One of these characteristics is the use of that clauses. Why that clauses? Because that clauses uh, syntactically and semantically plus the pra pragmatic point of view, they give promotional aspects of abstracts. This means what? This means that the researcher is highlighting his research. He is in a position to convince his readership. هنا أوعدنا بخطوات إضافية واتفقنا بعد المناقشة على أن ندفع الموضوع خطوة إلى الأمام. For example, this paper finds that American politicians make use of personal pronouns. other features in the method move. Some writers use the general, general subject, which is it, in order to avoid subjectivity, in order to highlight the objective side in a given research. So when there is a general subject, the researcher tries to conceal the source of evaluation in order to avoid embarrassment or in order to what to be objective, as I have mentioned. For instance, it is suggested that the student writers represent themselves as accomplishing more tasks. The uh, notion of tense here, we can use the present or what the past and this move. بالإضافة إلى ما ذكر في هذا المجال وفيما يخص أيضا موقف الباحث الشخصي عند كتابة الإطروحة والتعبير عن رأيه الشخصي بدون تردد الدكتور جواد كاظم جابر تدريس قسم الترجمة في كلية الأداء دكتور فارح صدام الإمارة رئيس قسم الترجمة كلية الأداء جامعة البصر